Hi there, this is K4A, Knowledge for All, educational videos channel. We are continuing with Scratch tutorials, we are continuing with explaining Scratch blocks, and in this video I am going to try to explain uh, how and when to use point in direction Scratch block. Ok, let's go to Scratch to internet to see that in action. In last video we have explained how to use change x scratch block to move character sprite only on x axis and not diagonally on or in any kind of different direction. So now, now our cat moves only to the left and right in straight lines and only to the top or bottom in the stra straight lines using X and Y or to be more precise using change X and change Y scratch blocks motion blocks okay uh, let's first let's let uh, this looks kind of messy and confusing and uh, so many things happening here so let's uh, first I will adjust move some blocks here and try to make it more clear what we are making here and what is happening here uh, we have defined our cat to move and I will now use and reorganize these blocks so they represent some kind of, kind of so they look like some kind of uh, joystick some kind of controls here visually also I will delete this move 10 steps, I don't need it. I will delete this change X, I don't need it anymore. And I will zoom now to this, what I have made here. So this is move to the right, this is move to the left, this is move up and this is move down. Great. It looks clearer now. but again lots of things happening here okay we have just seen that our cat is moving to the right and to the left and to the up and to the down as we wanted but we have some kind of problem from before which is when i move my cat to the left it works all uh, nice more or less but what I don't like here is that cat uh, didn't change its sprite here. It uh, didn't uh, move to the... It didn't uh, uh, change its head. It, look, it looks uh, same uh, if it walks to the left and to the right. Uh, we, the cat looks the same. It always looks to the right. They, uh, her eyes are always pointing to the right and her body is also always pointing to the right. That doesn't look very uh, nice, very realistic, very impressive. So we want to change this behavior somehow so our cat rotates and turns around so it looks more natural. Okay, so let's try to do it with this new block which we are explaining today and that is point in direction okay I uh, that is also one of the motion blocks it is blue one blue color so drag and drop it to your scratch programming window zoom it and let's see where to use it I want my cat to turn around when it moves to the left this is code for when my cat is cat is moving to the left so this is where I have to attach these blocks uh, somehow but first of all let's click it and see what will happen without attaching let's, let's just test it for a while I will first reset the cat to the starting position and I will click now on point in direction 90 I click on it and nothing happens. Uh, is that some kind of bug? Is it working or not? Well, if you have watched 
our previous video on direction what is direction i was explaining some kind of some uh, of those uh, issues which we will face here now and one of those is what is direction and how it works uh, direction is angle it's number which represents angle of rotation of your sprite of your character on the screen you can type it here as a number or you can click on this white arrow in blue circle here and drag and your cat will rotate and it looks sometimes it looks great sometimes it looks strange and funny but by default your default value is 90 that means 90 degrees that means right so the cat and any other sprite if we import any kind of sprite here default position uh, default value for uh, direction which means rotation will be 90 for any kind of sprite and this cat is looking to the right and its direction angle is 90 that is all cool but what if I want my cat to look to the left so one thing that comes in my mind is just to move this arrow to the left to the minus 90 and cat actually looks to the left but it's upside down so that's one kind of a problem we have we have solved the problem of cat not looking to the left now the cat is looking to the left but we have made another problem the cat is now upside down so we have solved one problem but we have made another problem here and that is actually like it or not that is common in programming and coding so uh, it will happen a lot when you start working on more com complex games uh, you will uh, fix one problem but you will make some other problems arise okay so i will turn it back to the 90 and i will go to the scratch wiki to see this direction page and maybe i have made something wrong okay let's check it here up right down left i want my cat to go to the left so it's minus 90 or 270 you don't uh, have to remember these values but they are very very simple and uh, made sense if you know how circle and angles work but if you don't you can always uh, look look them here on the direction value scratch wiki page if not you can always click on this circle and just drag wherever you want in my case i want just to check it if this will uh, value here 270 will change anything because when i move the cat here it was minus 90 and it was upside down now i will try to type it and now i will try to type it as a value here to see if something changes for better 270 no actually it's the same and it changed it from 270 to minus 90 again okay let's go back to 90 to make it normal and uh, try it like this for a second for a few seconds let's just try it like this it will look weird but i think it will work so what do what is our problem here here and what do we want to do here i want my cat my character to move to the left when i press left arrow key that's what we have done here it moves to the left it changes changes its costume and now i want it to look to the left to look to the left means to rotate to the left and as we have seen here in this circle here or on this page here we should type minus 90 or 20 270 for that kind of direction and now if everything works fine our cat will look to the left it will it will probably look upside down to the left but for now let's stick to this first problem okay i'm pressing right now it looks okay i'm pressing left okay so this this is working so so uh it looks strange because it's upside down and what kind of other problems i have made here i have also made problem that now when i press up or down or even right 
cat stays looking to the left upside down forever. Why is that? That is because this point in direction minus 90 worked. We pressed the left arrow, but we never set the scratch. Okay, that's for left arrow only. But when I press right, I want it to look to the right. And how to define that? We have to say point in direction to the right is 90. Okay, that's already by default here. So I will link it here, attach it here into the right arrow. So now I, ha uh, now I have told Scratch when the right arrow key is pressed, point uh, in direction 90. When the left key, key uh, is pressed, point to the minus 90. Let's see now if it works. It starts upside down, we will fix that also now. But let's try the right arrow. Yeah, it looks good. Left, it looks upside down, but at least it's looking to the left. And up and down will work nice if I have pressed up and down after the right key. So if I press right key for a couple of times and then up and down, it looks nice. But if I press left key for a couple of times and then up and down, it also stays upside down. I have to fix that also. So again, how to fix it? Just use common sense and logic. What I want Scratch to do for me, I want my cat to look to the right when I'm going up, so when I press the up arrow, up arrow key, point in direction 90, that means look to the right, and change uh, Y and next costume, that's cool, and same for the down arrow, when I press the down arrow key, point in direction 90, so now, now if I start the game, press the right, it looks cool, press the left, it doesn't look cool, but we will fix it soon, up looks cool, down looks cool, it works almost perfectly, we have only one problem here, and that is that cat is looking upside down when we are pointing to the left, we will have to solve it and we will do it in next videos, but for other keep arrows it works fine and the problem another problem which we will have here is also if we uh, press left arrow key for a couple of times and the cat is upside down and then i stop my game and then i start it again what do you think how the cat will start the cat should start upside down yeah why because we have left it like that in our game we have left it like that here for example we have left it upside down then restart it so scratch doesn't know that cat should be pointing to the right when the game starts so let's fix that also where are we saying to the scratch when the game is starting we are saying it here in this in this part of the code when the green arrow is clicked so we have defined here what we have defined here to get to be on the front layer, to be 100% big and to be on some specific position, that position is here uh, bottom left corner so it always resets to that point but we also want our cat to point to the right and that's easy, just attach this point in direction and start it and now cat will always start looking to the right so, even if we left it like here, reset it, it will always be reset nicely. Okay, so, as you have seen, it's not difficult, it's not um, hard to see what we have, uh, what uh, we are doing here. We are just using this new block point in direction to point our sprite in some kind of the, uh, in some kind of angle. Uh, you will mostly use it with these angles here, uh, which are 0, 90, 180, and 270, which represent up, right, down, and left, as you can see on this 
on this image which I have explained earlier in my what is direction video so 0 is up, 90 is right, 180 is down and minus 90 or 270 is left so you will use mostly those kind of values so don't worry no, that's not too much only four values to to try and experiment if you cannot remember them but you will if you could often but uh, as you have seen here the uh, tricky issue is to uh, just don't forget uh, that you have to use this point in direction if you have changed if, if you have used it for one kind of control for example for going to the right you also have to remember that you will probably have to use it also for some kind of other controls for left top down and so on so your uh, character will always point into the right direction so if i change it in one direction i will have probably to use this block on a couple of other places and for for example for as we have used it here for starting position so it always look uh, logical and cool on the screen and uh, let me make you just one simple example because some of you are still maybe confused why the cat is turning upside down when I press the left uh, is it some kind of uh, scratch bug is it something wrong is it error no it's not uh, uh, programmers would say it's not uh, it's not a bug it's a feature uh, why is it a feature why is it cool to to turn upside down because for some kind of your games you will um, you will need it actually to rotate like this and to turn upside down i uh, cannot um, nothing comes on my mind some uh, famous game or example where you can use it but i will show it uh, here for example if I, uh, I I clicked on choose a sprite and I will choose um, for example arrow which looks very very good for this it will be very very good for this example I want to make and that is uh, 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 for example or maybe to leave it for the next video mm. Yeah, no, uh, no, I can I can explain it here uh, because it will be I hope it will be fast, so I will just code it here for the for the arrow also. Yeah, just to uh, just to show you how this cat and this arrow they are both simple sprites. The arrow is kind of simpler, but uh, I want to show you how the arrow will look good when we use this new block pointing direction and it will not look as strange as cat it will not look turned upside down because this is this sprite is different and i will explain it in a second so i'll just code this fast we have used these blocks uh, before so i need four directions when i have to zoom it first when space key pressed i need four of those i i'm just making now controls for the arrow and i'm i want to use this uh, we don't have to code it to move just to point in direction cat is coded with moving but the arrow will be only pointing and rotating and not moving i will duplicate it four times and i will snap it to those new blocks here and let's code it let's go again onto this direction page so up arrow points to the zero so when up arrow is key is pressed go to the zero when right arrow is key is pressed go to the right which is 90 degrees that is direction when bottom or down arrow is pressed go to the 100 and 
80. And when left arrow is pressed go, I will drag this one instead of typing, go to the minus 90. So if I click on the stage now and press up, down, right, left, it looks great and it works great. And now maybe some of you are still confused here why when I press the left key, why the, this arrow looks good and this cat is upside down. That is because this arrow is sprite which is made as top down. That means it is like you are watching it from the airplane, from some kind of air perspective, from top down perspective, from above, from the top. And for some kind of games you will need uh, to make characters like that like this arrow is here or for example maybe for some uh, tower defense game where you have turrets and so on towers uh, for some top down, uh, top down shooters like zombie shooters top down and so on and for some kind of games you will have to and then when you make some uh, some games like that top down games you don't have to worry about looking strange when going to the left or any kind of direction it will always look good but for some kind of games where you have characters like cat which we have here uh, they will not look good if you use only point in direction you will have to use some kind of other blocks which we will um, explain in next video but i just wanted to show you that some sometimes like with this arrow and top-down games you will have some top-down sprites which will look good in, ev in every kind of direction but for some kind of sprites like with this cat it will not look good and you will have to solve solve this problem of turning upside down which will we will uh, resolve in next video okay that's it for this video and in next video i think i will uh, hopefully I will fix this cat so it uh, looks natural when it goes to the left so it not it's not upside down but it looks normal okay and that's it for now bye